Hello there world, Bettina Carey here, and I'm the founder and CEO of We Empower You, the community and the movement, and WeEmpowerYourLife.com. And with me today is one, none other than Lori Sugawa-Whaley. She's a returning guest to the Global Summit, which will be happening tomorrow on December the 8th from 8.30 a.m. to 8.30 p.m. She's gonna be doing a really fantastic topic, and she's here today to share with us exactly what she's gonna be talking about. Thank you so much, uh, Lori, for joining me here today. It's great to have you. Well, thank you, Bettina. It's great to be here too. <laughs> Wonderful. So Gambaru is the short name for what you're gonna be talking about. What's the definition of Gambaru and why is it so essential to us these days? Well, Gambaru is a word that it can't be summarized in one word or a few words in English. So it's try your hardest, do your best, never give up and go for broke. And the problem with some people have is they re, they work so hard on a problem or an issue or their dream or vision, and then they stop just short of the completion. And that's what I love to help people with because samurai don't give up. And I am samurai. I'm the samurai woman, Lori. And I help people and any of you that want to reach your goals, but you think that there's not a way, but that will get, help you have the resolve of a samurai warrior. That's fantastic. So your topic tomorrow is Gambaru in Japanese and of course the longer version you just gave us. So what can folks expect to hear from you and what might they take away as, a, as an attendee to the summit? Well, uh, specifically, my speech is going to be very inspirational in nature because so many people ha have gone before us and have conquered obstacles that may seem insurmountable, but with determination, they, re they reach their goals. A good example would be Helen Keller, who was born, well, not born, but later, just when she was very young, became deaf and blind and but yet she graduated from high school and college wrote a book and she traveled the world so if she can do that with those handicaps what do what what is our what can we do with our with having vision and being able to hear and the world is is like our is like a bed spread, bed right in front of us and it's up to us to find that thing that inspires us and drives us and so we can uh, give, share our gift with the world. Yes, that sounds fantastic. And so it's really important uh, these days, more than ever before, that we have that stick to itiveness, that gambaru spirit to mm -hmm. make it through this uh, opportunity that we have in life uh, when we have to dig really deep for that strength and that perseverance. And so share with us also, you have a, a book that uh, was released just at the top of COVID. March of 2020. Um, tell us a little bit about your book, what inspired you to write it, and um, the title of your book is Let the Samurai Be Your Guide. So maybe you start with the story of how you are a samurai warrior. Yes, I'd love to share that. I found out through our relatives in Japan that our family crest was one of the five main samurai crests of field Japan. Actually, I found that out through research. They gave it to me and I kind of put it away and I thought, well, that's nice. And I started after my accident in 05 and 07, I started drawing deep within me, going online and researching. And I found out that our family crest was one of the five main samurai crests of feudal Japan. So I know that that DNA of the warrior is in me. And so I set a goal to write a book. And the first book was published in 15, it was self-published. Then in 18, 2018, Tuttle Publishing offered me a contract and, and that was <laughs> that was like this. I couldn't, you know, it was hard to believe that this ha was happening, but it did. And here is the, the book. It's called Let the Samurai Be Your Guide uh, by Tuttle Publishing. And it's about the seven principles that the samurai live by called the Kota Bushido, courage, integrity, benevolence, respect, honesty, honor, and loyalty. And then as the author, I added Gambaru because those Gambaru is an overarching thing that will help anybody with any of the principles carry it through. Fantastic. Well, Lori, it's been great to have you here today. We're looking forward to your session. And of course, you're also a member of the We Empower You Global Virtual Summit and membership. So share with us a little bit about your membership and what you are getting value out of it. 
Well, yes, I'd love to. And what um, I received from the the benefit, or I'm sorry, from the membership, are all the opportunities that are available through We Empower You membership. I was one of, I believe, one of the founding members because I saw the opportunity. I go, oh, that looks interesting. That looks great, and so I jumped on. And there's opportunities such as being on television. And I'm excited about that. And there's so many other opportunities and being around people that are like-minded that will help you accomplish your goals, whatever they can be. It could be it could be in any different field, but we empower you and the membership and the opportunities available in the membership and the people that you surround yourself with will also help you get there. Fantastic. Thank you again for coming here today and exploring a little bit about your talk. For those of you who are out there on Facebook land or YouTube and you're listening and you want to be a part of this, go to the weempoweryourlife.com website, click on the summit tickets tab and get your free admission. We have 500 admissions that we are giving away and we'd love to have you at the summit. Again, thank you, Lori. Thank you. Bye-bye. Hope to Bye. see you tomorrow. Great. See you at the summit. Everybody. Yeah, see you at the summit. <laughs>